Hi guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. Let's do my little gummy bears. My little gummy bears. Oh, I just feel like I gotta burst the energy from you guys. I hope so. I hope so. Let's see what my gummies are up to. So it's gonna be Rala. It's gonna be March, the rest of 2019. Not the rest of 2019. The rest of March 2019. <gasps> Holy moly. Gemini. Gemini. Oh, like I feel like you guys are on fire. I don't know. I like it. I like it. The lovers. Well, there you are, right in your element. See? You guys are on fire. Whomever. It would make sense, right? It's the twins. But whomever this is for, I don't know if it's just a specific message, but you guys are moon babies. The two of you are. Someone has a lot of Gemini in their chart. Someone's moon is Gemini too. So if that is the case, then this read, chances are, is going to connect with you. It should, it could resonate with any, any Gemini. I'm just saying. It would be a, a if you're a Gemini moon, you know you're a moon baby. There's something in this read. So you have the six of pence. This is, this is, you know, someone's looking up to you. All right. It's, it's also, there's a gift here, but it's a spiritual gift. And I, and I kind of see it linked. So it's some kind of gift either you or your lover has, or it's a decision whether or not with the seven of pence, you know, you want to invest time with this person. Because when the lover, lovers come out, it's usually a, a very important decision because there's love. There's a lot of love. Sometimes love goes away, but there's still lingering love, okay? I don't know if it's between two people or not. We do have three people here, and I never, ever read this card like this, but it's more about balancing out a situation, it, choosing whether or not you want to invest time in this, in someone. So could there have been a third party at one point? And something ended, maybe they stayed with that karmic for a little while and now it's coming back around and you're going to have to make a decision. Because this is making a decision whether or not you want to invest time in a situation again. But I don't feel it being bad. You know, you got the five of wands reverse. So see, this is somebody who doesn't want to come out of conflict. Somebody does not want to be in conflict with someone anymore so there is a decision to be made and someone just does not want to argue somebody wants to make something right for sure you got the four of swords so somebody healed from a situation okay is in the midst of healing but someone here has major anxiety about this person coming back around because it's obviously somebody that's important enough where you're going to consider whether or not to spend time to invest time with this person again. This person or you does want to ground a situation, does not want to argue with you anymore. You know, they're hoping that you've healed from whatever went down in the past. And I think that's why I feel this external energy. I don't feel deception. Could they have lied about a third party? Yeah, but I, I really feel more of external sexual energy. You guys have a, a sexual connection too. 
but it's not screaming at me. You know, it's just, I know it's there. So tell me about this lover. So you need to decide whether or not you want to come out of conflict with somebody for sure. Okay. It looks like you're definitely going to have to make the choice whether or not you want to invest time in somebody, whomever this person is, whomever this lover is. I really feel like it's a Jemmy and Jemmy, you know, or Pisces. You got the moon reversed. So this is secrets coming out. This is, you know, if it's secrets, it's just something coming out, okay? And if you are confused, you are going to come out of confusion. But remember I said something about a moon child? Like, I don't know. There's something here, guys. I, I can't quite pin it, but it's here. Some of you have a spiritual gift. I don't know if you want to use it or not. Or maybe you just don't know how. But if this is you guys, try not to stress out too much, okay? Try to get your rest. I know it's hard, especially with the full moon. For sure, it's hard. But um, necessary. Because you've already healed from this. So when the Four of Swords comes up for me, it's like old heal, old wounds kind of being exposed again. Because this doesn't look like this is something that happened recent. This is something where there's been some separation. Because I would see so much more if this was like a recent breakup. It's not. Some time has gone by. best advice this is so clear cut I, I don't need to dig I, we would get the same story I already know so you definitely am gonna have to make a decision okay and now we got the A to air and you know this is you afraid to take action okay um, an illusion of being trapped. So this, this for sure, guys, you, you had a bond with this person because you're not going to know what to do. And then you pull the life experience, you know, it's a significant life event, a powerful revolution to something. It, this is going to lead to change. So spread your wings. So like I said, it's it's straightforward. This is somebody from the past, whether they're in your life right now and you guys are discussing this or not, it's pretty significant. I could feel it. So if you choose to move forward, you know, it, it looks like you can, and that's why it's a big decision. It's a big decision, guys. Okay. So just... It's, it's going to be conflicting energy, for sure. So just try to stay strong, okay? Um, you can reach those goals, but you got to talk about them too. Okay? It's a long talk that's needed here. It's It's a soul. It's a soul talk. Try to get some rest, okay? Um, it's just you feeling in this... I don't really feel like you feel trapped. It's just... You're having a hard time sleeping. You don't want to argue. You're not really seeing eye to eye, but it's not worth arguing about. It was so long ago, but there's such a bond here. It's... Do I... You know... It just... Regardless, hear this person out or or vice versa. If this is on your mind and you got to go to somebody, you know, it was meant for everything to go down this way. It's a significant life event, okay? Do your best to push through this energy. It, Like I said in the beginning, it, it feels good. It's like, it feels good. It, even though it's like, Blah right now. It's not blah. It's just like, I don't know how to explain it. It's draining. Whatever you're going through is draining. 
but it's going to be good. If you choose from your soul and you know what your soul is telling you, it's going to be a good scenario. What's at the bottom of the deck? Okay, it's the magician. So, yeah, if you choose to create, you know, if you choose to. I love you guys. Have a good one.